Colon cancer, also known as colorectal cancer, can affect both men and women. While the symptoms of colon cancer can vary from person to person, here are some common signs and symptoms that men and women should be aware of. 1. Change in bowel habits. Persistent diarrhea or constipation. Changes in the size, shape, or consistency of your stool. 2. Blood in the stool. Bright red or dark, tarry blood in the stool. Blood on the toilet paper or in the toilet bowl. 3. Abdominal discomfort. Persistent abdominal pain, cramps, or discomfort. Bloating or a feeling of fullness in the abdomen. 4. Unexplained weight loss. Significant, unexplained weight loss without changes in diet or activity. 5. Fatigue. Ongoing fatigue or weakness. 6. Anemia. Low red blood cell count, anemia, can lead to fatigue, paleness, and weakness. 7. Bowel obstruction. Sudden and severe abdominal pain. Inability to pass stool or gas. 8. Changes in bowel habits. Feeling that the bowel does not completely empty after a bowel movement. Before we move on, would you please help us out? If you like this type of content please hit the like button, subscribe to our channel, and turn on notifications. It really helps us on YouTube and helps others see our content. Also check out the description section below for special information to help you in your health journey. How is colon cancer detected? 1. Colonoscopy. A colonoscopy is one of the most effective and commonly used screening methods for colon cancer. During this procedure, a flexible, lighted tube with a camera on the end, colonoscope, is inserted into the rectum and advanced through the colon. This allows the doctor to examine the entire colon and rectum for polyps, tumors, or other abnormalities. If any polyps are found, they can often be removed during the procedure. 2. Fecal Occult Blood Test FOBT. This test checks for hidden blood in the stool, which can be a sign of colon cancer. It is a non-invasive test that involves collecting small stool samples and sending them to a laboratory for analysis. Positive results may lead to further testing, such as a colonoscopy. 3. Fecal Immunochemical Test FIT. FIT is another stool-based test that detects the presence of blood in the stool. It is more specific for human blood and may have fewer false positives than the FOBT. 4. Stool DNA Test this test, such as Cologard, not only detects blood in the stool but also checks for DNA changes associated with colon cancer. A positive result on this test usually leads to a colonoscopy for further evaluation. 5. Virtual colonoscopy, cork colonography. This is a non-invasive imaging test that uses a CT scanner to create detailed images of the colon. It is used to detect polyps or tumors, and if abnormalities are found, a traditional colonoscopy may be recommended for further evaluation or removal. 6. Flexible sigmoidoscopy. This procedure is similar to a colonoscopy but focuses on the lower part of the colon and rectum. It is often used as a screening tool, but if any abnormalities are found, a full colonoscopy may be required. 7. Barium enema. This test involves the use of a contrast material, barium, and x-rays to visualize the colon. While it's less commonly used today, it can still be effective in certain cases. 8. Blood tests. Blood tests may be done to check for specific tumor markers or assess general health. Elevated levels of certain markers, such as CEA, carcinoembryonic antigen, can sometimes indicate the presence of colon cancer. How to prevent colon cancer? 1. Regular screening. Screening for colon cancer is one of the most effective ways to prevent it. Starting at age 45 to 50, or earlier if you have risk factors, such as a family history of the disease, regular screenings like colonoscopies, fecal occult blood tests, FOBT, fecal immunochemical tests, FIT, or stool DNA tests can help detect and remove precancerous polyps or identify cancer at an early, more treatable stage. 2. Healthy diet. A diet rich in fruits, vegetables, whole grains, and low in red and processed meats can help lower your risk of colon cancer. Fiber from these foods can help with regular bowel movements and reduce exposure to potential carcinogens in the colon. 3. Limit red and processed meats. Red meats, such as beef, pork, and lamb, and processed meats, like bacon, hot dogs, and sausages, have been associated with an increased risk of colon cancer. Limit your consumption of these meats. 4. Maintain a healthy weight. Obesity is a risk factor for colon cancer. Maintaining a healthy weight through a balanced diet and regular exercise can reduce your risk. 5. Regular physical activity. 
Engaging in regular physical activity, such as brisk walking, jogging, or swimming, can help reduce your risk of colon cancer. Aim for at least 150 minutes of moderate intensity exercise per week. 6. Limit alcohol consumption. Excessive alcohol consumption has been linked to an increased risk of colon cancer. If you choose to drink alcohol, do so in moderation. 7. Tobacco cessation. Smoking is a known risk factor for various types of cancer, including colon cancer. If you smoke, quitting is one of the best things you can do for your overall health. 8. Avoid excessive sugary drinks. High consumption of sugary drinks has been associated with an increased risk of colon cancer. Opt for water, unsweetened beverages, or limited amounts of fruit juice. 9. Increase calcium and vitamin D intake. Some studies suggest that adequate intake of calcium and vitamin D may reduce the risk of colon cancer. You can get these nutrients from dairy products, fortified foods, and supplements if necessary. 10. Aspirin and NSAIDs. Some evidence suggests that taking aspirin or non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs, NSAIDs, may lower the risk of colon cancer. However, these medications should only be used under the guidance of a healthcare professional, as they come with potential side effects. 11. Stay hydrated. Drinking plenty of water and staying well hydrated may contribute to a healthy colon. 12. Know your family history. If you have a family history of colon cancer or a known genetic predisposition, discuss your risk with a healthcare provider. They may recommend more frequent or earlier screenings. Supplements to prevent colon cancer. 1. Calcium. Some studies suggest that calcium supplements may have a protective effect against colon cancer, particularly in individuals with a low dietary calcium intake. It's important to get the right balance of calcium through diet and supplements, as excessive calcium intake may have adverse effects. 2. Vitamin D. Vitamin D is important for overall health, and there is evidence to suggest that it may play a role in reducing the risk of colorectal cancer. Vitamin D supplements may be recommended, especially for individuals with low vitamin D levels. 3. Folic acid, folate, adequate folate intake from dietary sources and supplements may help reduce the risk of colon cancer, especially in individuals with a family history of the disease. Folate is a B vitamin, and it's essential for DNA synthesis and repair. 4. Omega-3 fatty acids. Some research has examined the role of omega-3 fatty acids in colon cancer prevention. Omega-3 supplements are available, but it's generally better to obtain these fatty acids through dietary sources like fatty fish, e.g., salmon, mackerel, and flax seeds. 5. Turmeric, curcumin, curcumin, a compound found in turmeric, has been studied for its potential anti-inflammatory and anti-cancer properties. While there is some promising research, it's important to consult with a healthcare provider before taking curcumin supplements. 6. Green tea extract, some studies have suggested that compounds in green tea, such as epigallocatechin gallate, EGCG, may have anti-cancer properties. Green tea extract supplements are available, but their efficacy in preventing colon cancer is still being researched. Colon cancer statistics for men. 1. Incidence. Colon cancer is one of the most commonly diagnosed cancers in men worldwide. The incidence rate may vary by region and ethnicity. In the United States, it was estimated that in 2021, there would be around 49,580 new cases of colon cancer in men. 2. Age. The risk of colon cancer increases with age. It is more common in older adults. Most cases are diagnosed in people over the age of 50, with the risk increasing significantly after this age. 3. Mortality. Colon cancer is a leading cause of cancer-related deaths among men. The mortality rate varies by factors such as the stage at diagnosis and access to medical care. In the United States, it was estimated that there would be approximately 28,130 deaths from colon cancer in men in 2021. 4. Racial and ethnic disparities. There are variations in colon cancer incidence and mortality rates among different racial and ethnic groups. African American men tend to have a higher incidence and mortality rate compared to other groups. This disparity may be due to various factors, including healthcare access and socioeconomic factors. 5. Screening and early detection. Regular screenings, such as colonoscopies, can significantly reduce the incidence and mortality of colon cancer by detecting and removing precancerous polyps or identifying cancer at an early, more treatable stage. Screening rates among men may vary, but it's important for individuals to discuss screening options with their healthcare providers. 
6. Risk factors. Several risk factors for colon cancer in men include family history of the disease, personal history of polyps or inflammatory bowel disease, a diet high in red and processed meats, lack of physical activity, smoking, and excessive alcohol consumption. 7. Prevention. Lifestyle factors such as a healthy diet, regular physical activity, maintaining a healthy weight, and not smoking can help reduce the risk of colon cancer in men. Disclaimer. Always check with your doctor before trying anything, especially if you are on medication. This information is just to be used as general knowledge and not medical advice. Thanks for watching our video. Please hit the like button, subscribe to our channel, and turn on the notification button so you don't miss a video.